<laughs> well, this is TV history. Steve has actually been quiet and let's celebrate. Let's have some mouse trap. Uh. <laughs> Welcome once again to another game of... Yes, now this young lad here is... Jeremy. And this young lady here is... Kirsty. Yes, now Jeremy, what sort of sports do you like? Street hockey. You like street hockey? Well, that's a bit of luck, because we've got a little bit of a game of golf in today's game, so you should be pretty good at that, do you reckon? Yep. Yep. And Kirsty, what are you into? And detective stories. You're into detective stories, mystery, murder, mayhem. Well, we've got a little bit of a mystery today because are these lot going to do it in eight minutes? Well, we'll soon find out. Now, let's have a look who we've got over there. We've got Wicked Wayne, yes, and the Trap Mechanic. <laughs> Nasty man, nasty man. Now, listen to me, because I'm going to explain the rules to you now, all right? You've got eight minutes to get round the circuit, all right? You must complete all obstacles on the way. At each corner, you'll get a timeout square where we'll stop the clock and you'll pick up some extra prizes. Have you got that? Now, if you do the circuit in eight minutes, you will win the chance to enter the trap and play for today's star prize, which is a mountain bike! <laughs> But if you don't do it in eight minutes, the trap will fire, the cage will fall, you'll lose a five-star prize, but we will replace it with a four-star prize. But we'll have to wait till we get there. You know what I mean? We'll have to see what happens. Because I reckon you could win the mountain bike. I know you both want to do it. So, but there's also something that will happen during the game. You will hear this sound. <laughs> yes, that means the trap has been fired. When that happens, you can see the ball will kick the bucket. The bucket will turn over, the ball will run out. That means you've got a race, race round the outside as fast as your little legs can carry you. You've got to tag each other. You've got to get in the middle and turn off the steam valve before the ball reaches this point. Otherwise, the green ball falls. It falls through there. It falls through the bath. The man takes a backward somersault. And, oh, the cage. The cage falls over your prize. All right. So you understand the rules? You're with me on that one. Right, let's have a look down the first side, shall we? First of all, you've got to race through there, OK? You've got to climb through there, you've got to go through balloons. They all fly everywhere, we know that. Then you've got a puzzle to sort out. We'll get to that in a minute. And then you can see you've got to get ten balls into the top of that funnel there, and I've got to see them in the tube. I want ten, all right? And then we hit a question square. Now, I want three correct answers to the questions. If you don't know an answer to a question, please say pass, all right? It's your time to say pass. OK, do you understand what you've got to do? Are you with me? You're not nervous, are you, Kirsty? You are, right? I can tell you're nervous. Never mind, we're going to get going. Is the trap ready? Yeah! It's been reset. Is the clock ready? Yeah! Right, let's have the count. Three, Three two, two, one, one go! go! Go, through you go, through you go. Through you go, fast you can, fast you can. Out the other side, out the other side. Come on, I need you both out, I need you both out. Whoa, take your time, take your time. Right, now you've got a range of jigsaw. It makes a very famous face. It's a face of a very famous person on telly. In fact, it looks very much like, um, my face. The trap has been fired! The trap! Got, you don't need to go. You've got to go through there. Turn off the valve. All right. The ball's on its way. Come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it! Yes, go on! Get to the steam valve! Yes! And back again, and back again, come on. Come on, come back, Kirsty, come on, it's your time! It is your time, you never walk in this game. Nobody walks. Right, go on, can you build this face? Can you build this face? He looks like a motor mouth presenter to me. Oh dear, oh dear. Come on. I don't look as bad as that, do I? Oh dear. That must be early morning. Right, here we go, here we go. Yes, we're together, right, come on, on here. I want ten balls in there. I want to count ten balls. Come on. Come on, come on, get them in. How many have we got? You're just throwing them in the air, Kirsten. Get them in, get them in. Come on, you got me faster than that. Come on, you've got one. You can do it! We've got eight! 
Yeah, Brian. You're no good at netball, are you? Now we got to... We got ten! On to the question square. Right, now, OK, three correct answers, all right, before you can move on, all right. Which metal is liquid at room temperature? Metal, liquid? You don't know, say pass. Pass. Mercury. Can peacocks fly? No, no. Oh, well, they can. It's yes. How many hours does a bacterian... How many humps does a bacterian camel have? One. No, it's two. What do the initials E.T. stand for? Extraterrestrial. Extraterrestrial, yes, you've got one. In the proverb, what do too many cooks do? Spoil the broth. They spoil the broth. There's two you got. Which language do the people of Austria speak? Austrian. No, it's not. It's German. The Japanese hobby of bonsai means the growing of miniature what? Trees. Trees! On to the time ask it! Stop the <laughs> Whoa! You took your time, I think, along that side there. You did indeed, you did, especially trying to throw those things in. But never mind, let's see what you won. You won these pens and these bum bags! <laughs> right, now, let's have a look down this side, shall we? Let's have a look down here. Right, now, 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 now. Let's see, you've got this obstacle here. Now, what you've got to do is you've got to get three bags each through the hoops, and they should be caught in the net. So I want three bags in it. So you've got to throw them really hard to get them in there, OK? So you got that. Then we've got some questions for you. I want three correct answers for you can move on. Then you get, get across the string bridge there. Can you see it, that rope bridge? Then you've got a puzzle on the end there, and then we hit the time out. And you've got about five and a half minutes, so you've really got to go for it. OK, you're slightly under time at the moment. So I hope your aim's good, because it's time to go! Come on! Oh, come on! We've got one! Square. On to the question square here. Which sport do Jennifer Caprati and Stephanie Graf play? Tennis. Lord tennis is correct. Yeah, I can hear the trap. I can add his way here. <laughs> Come on. Come on, you've got to get through there. Go away, Steve. You've got to get through there. You've got to get through there. Come on. Go for it. Go for it. You can make it. You can make it. Yes, I'm back again. What? Come on, come on, come on, come on. A collection or a group of what is called a flotilla? A collection of what is called a flotilla? Don't know. It's Pass. boats. Which country's revolution began with the storming of the Bastille? Storming of the Bastille in what country? Don't know. It's Pass. France. I was trying to give you a clue there. In which indoor sport might you score strikes out or spares in an alley? Strikes or spares in an alley? Bowling. Yes, bowling. That's two you got. What animal would you expect to be called Brock? What animal would you expect to be called Brock? Brock and his... Uh, Pass. Badger. How many stripes does a sergeant have? Three. Yeah, there's three! Get across that drawbridge! Come on, I'll move this for you. Come on. Across you go. Across you go. Come on. Come on, both of you. Come on. Right. Come on, come on. Here. On to the puzzle here. Right, now, this is a famous book and a film. You've got to try and work out what it is as I put down the words. The. Any, any ideas? And. And the. And the. And the. Chocolate. Really no, it isn't. Not Willie. Really. It is. We've got factory, Charlie but it's, chocolate, it's Charlie. I'll just find out square. Stop the clock. <laughs> oh. Well, I think you raced through that one. You managed to uh, stop the trap in time, so you hung on to the mountain bikes. You're still playing for the mountain bikes. That's just really good. But also, you've won this Space Crusade game. <laughs> Side, shall we? Come on, let's have a see what we've got down here. Now, we've got a puzzle here. Oh, yes, that should make a famous name there. You should be able to do that easily. And then you've got to fly through that hoop. And then we're on to a question square, all right? And then we get a nice, relaxing game of golf, all right? You should be good at this, because you said you do street cocky. And you've got just under four minutes to do it in. Oh, how are you feeling? Are you feeling confident? Do you think you're yep. going to do it? Yeah. Do you think you're going to be taking those mountain bikes home with you? Oh, <laughs> Kirsty, that's really bad luck. Well, we'll soon find out because it's time to go. Come on, that's a famous name. Yes, I think we're getting there. Begins with M. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's a famous singer. He's a famous American singer. Come on, come on. You could do it. You could do it. Come on. Are you there? Oh, this is a really bad singer. That gives you a big clue, actually. Yes, yes. No, no, it's not Miak. Yes, we're getting there. We're getting there. Come on, no, 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 no. What goes with it? Yes? Michael, Michael, Jack. No, this is Jack. Son, right, through here. Come on. Come on. You can get through there. Come on, you can do it. Yes. 
I'll do crash this way. Come on, help him out. Help Jamie out. Come on. You need him to get out. <laughs> Splat. Splat. <laughs> right, it's a question. OK, I want three answers. Which musical instrument is Nigel Kennedy famous for playing? Violin. It is the violin. In long cycle races, the leading rider each day wears what colour jersey? Yellow jersey. It is yellow. How much is 750 pence? £7.50. You get £7.50, right! Go! Right! I want six balls! I want you to stand on that square there, and I want six balls through here. OK. Yes! One! <laughs> two! The trap! The trap! Go on. How are you going to get round? How are you going to do it? You're going to run over there, are you? Which way are you going to go? Go! Go for it! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on, come on! We've got the golf game. Come on. I want six. Yes, we've got three. And we've got four. We need two more. Five. You can tell he plays street hockey. Six! Up to the timeout square. Stop the clock. I think you made brilliant time up there, and you made really good time. I think your street hockey really paid for itself then, didn't it? Because look what you've won. You won these trainers! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let's have a look down this side. Whoa! What can I see? What can I see down the end there? I can still see a mountain bike. Whoa, so you're still playing for that then. Now let's have a look, see what you've got to do. You've got to answer three questions, and you've got to get across that pole there. Then we've got a puzzle for you to sort out, and then you've got to knock the balloons off there with those coloured balls. Can you see that at the end there? It's like a coconut shy sort of thing. And then we've got a timeout at the end there. And let me tell you how long you've got. You've got just over two minutes. Oh. <laughs> So you're going to have to go for it on this one. All right. Let me... I'm going to take as little time as I can, so I'm going to get down here so I can pick up the questions. All right. Are you ready? Are you steady? Go! Right, on to the first square. Let's have some questions out of here. Which sailor crossed the Atlantic? Oh, no! Which way are you going to go? Which way are you going to go? This way. Come on, come on, come on. Go for it! Come on, you still, you still got to keep going. Which sailor crossed the Atlantic in 1492 to discover America? Oh, it no, was Columbus. It was Columbus. If you, if you, gil if you gilded something, what colour would it be? Gilded? Black. It would be gold. You're still playing for another prize. Don't worry. What gas is expelled from the lungs? Expelled. Uh, carbon. Ca carbon, carbon, carbon dioxide. dioxide. That's right. What do you have to break to make an omelette? Eggs. 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 Yes, you got two. What trees do conquer grow on? The crock is growing, what tree? Oh, Chestnut. How's Chestnut's going across his pole? Come on, he's still playing for the four star prize. Come on. Get your feet up, come on. Come on. Oh, go back, you've got to go back, Jeremy. Come on. You're playing for a black and white tally now. You're playing for a tally. Come on, Jeremy. Come on. Come on, come on, Jeremy. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's give him a hand. Get off, get off, come on here, quick, come on, let's let you in, you go win the tennis. Right, now you've got to get the sides. New shapes of sides. You want the shorter side, this side, more than both sides, this side. So what's the left sides on this? Triangle, you're correct, triangle. What's the triangle? Rectangle. What's the rectangle? Rectangle. Pentagon's correct. What's the pentagon? Hexagon, yes. Heptagon. No, no, the other way around. Yes, come on, come on, quick. Three blue. Come on, come on. Come on, yes. Come on, knock them off. Come on. Come on. You've got a very short time. Come on, Come on! Come on, stop the clock! Oh. 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 I didn't think you were going to do it, but you did! That means you've won this brilliant bag! Oh. Oh. Now, 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 now! You're, you've lost. You did lose the mountain bike that time, but we've replaced it with a black and white telly. So now it's time to enter the trap. So come on, come on, this way, this way. Come on, over to here, over to here. Right, right, can you see here? You've got a black and white telly. Mountain bike's gone, but you're still playing for the telly. All right, that's not too bad, is it? It's not too bad. All these prizes plus a telly. All right, all right, so I'll tell you what you've got to do. You've got to answer three questions. 
all right? Mm. Now, I've got a load of questions here. If you don't know the answers to them, say pass. Don't stand there going, um, uh, ooh, 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 just say pass, all right? Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to fire the trap. All right, so when I fire the trap, you've got the length of time it takes to go around and the cage to fall. So you've got to get the three answered before the cage falls. All right, so you're playing for the telly. All right, are you relaxed? Are you calm? Are you ready for these questions? Start the trap! Right, who wrote the stories about Peter Rabbit and Mrs. Tiggy Winkle? Peter Potter. Peter is correct. What is the only river that flows through Egypt? No. The Nile is correct. And anaconda is a very large what? Anaconda? Spider. No, it isn't a spider, it's a snake. Who was Adam's girlfriend? I don't know. It was Eve. Which secret agent has number 007? Jane Bond. Jane Bond! Not the yes! 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 Yes, Kirsty! Look at Kirsty leaping up and down. You've won the black and white television. Oh, brilliant. We'll see you next week for another game of... No! Yes! 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 Why? Bye, bye, bye. Give me a wake-up, bye. Go on. <laughs>